out the sun under a blazing tropical heat lamp. Gaze upon the most gl glittery jewelry in the entire Yucky Mart. But that's nothing compared to the squishy towers. A c -c colossal condo of double ply toilet paper. Or the double squish ranch and its herd of thoroughbred race roaches. W -w Welcome to Lifestyles of the Rich and the Disgusting. I'm your host, Serge. All these wonders are owned by the world's richest banana, Ricardo. His peel to riches tale is the stuff of legend. Join me now for a peek at R R Ricardo's high-priced, trend-setting lifestyle. Ah, muy picante. Let the interview begin. Ricardo, you live a life of glitzy gluttony. What more could an overripe tropical fruit ask for? Excellent question, my television companion, but definitely not my real-life friend. What more could I ask for? Hey, how about my pedicure over here? Right away, boss. Gotta keep those rich, rich tootsies trimmed. <laughs> I have many rich banana things to do, but still I stay in touch with the little people. Like this ever-ripening fellow. <laughs> Don't give me that hoity-toity fancy talk. I was rich before your bunch even fell out of the tree. <laughs> I had it all. Friends, music, and all the stale chocolate coins you could eat. <laughs> but I lost it all. Betrayed by my best pal and my best gal. <laughs> what I'm saying is, don't trust nobody. Excellent advice. Everybody out! <laughs> Too bad, so sad. Come back when you're rich like me. I'm not sure that's the moral of my story. Or is it? Hey, stop, thieves! You have stolen my precious Blotto tickets and ignited my fiery banana rage! <laughs> Time for us to banana split! Ricardo's gone crazy! I know, right? It's positively shocking! We're trapped! But I'm not going down without a fight! What do you know? This flat battery still has some juice! You sure do, Serge! <laughs> but I got all the blood on tickets! <laughs> Never trust a fully loaded sub! They always want everything on it! Those tickets are mine! Actually, the tickets are mine! Finders keepers, losers weepers! Perhaps. But I assure you I will not be the one weeping, my footlong friend. Oh, yeah? Well, we'll, we'll, we'll see about that. Give me those Give me tickets. Give me those tickets. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Ow! Ow, ow. Uh -huh. ow. Uh, my head. Oh, ah. oh. I am coming for you, my precious. Oh, no, you don't. They are all winners and all mine. All ours. Oh. 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 Stinky? How dare you slam my own gates in my own handsome banana face? Ain't yours anymore, bub. You flat busted. But I used that chocolate coin you gave me to scratch and win a blotto ticket that fell right out of the sky. Now all of you dead beats are working for me. Come on, you lazy slow pokes. I hired you to bob for toilet pennies, and that's what you're gonna do. Eh, it's a living. We've been lost at sea for days. More like 30 seconds, but who's counting? Every food for himself! Ah! Ah! Land ho! Land who? Ah! 
Land here! Hola, landlubbers! I am the renowned and also oh irresistible a Capitan Ricardo. Welcome to my noble vessel, the SS Numero Dos. You call this soggy diaper a vessel? But of course! Behold! The sails are made from the finest snotty tissue. Now, my delectably fragrant sea dogs, hoist the hairnet! So sweet, yet so dumb. The big net over the side. Dump it on the poop deck and be quick about it. You are wanting a ship. Well, now we have the greatest ship on the Yucky Mart Sea. Ooh, we got another bite. Well, what are you waiting for? Reel her in. What took you so long? I thought I'd never get rescued. Ooh, it's Meathead. Let's throw him back. No, let me stay. I'll sweep the poop deck. I'll even poop first, then sweep it. <laughs> Unhand that sandwich. I, Capitan Ricardo, says that Meathead stays. Oh, yeah? Well, I say he goes. This tub needs a new captain. And my wood-fired crust and delicious four-cheese blend make me the perfect choice. So it's mutiny. I will see you walk the plank for this. My foolish friend. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Oops. My bad. All hands on deck. Start bailing. Ah! Plug that hole. I am too handsome to be waterlogged. <laughs> now, where were we? relish and mayo, swished it around in your head, and dribbled it back out your nose. <coughs> I'm not sick. <laughs> Incoming! Maybe you ought to stay in bed. <sighs> I told you I'm fine. See? All better. Now let's go grease skating. <sighs> Check out my pussy pirouette! Whoa! <laughs> yeah. Ta-da! Top that, meathead! Easy! Welcome to Splitsville! <laughs> oh, that's stingy! <laughs> that's nothing! Check this out! <laughs> oh no! He's gonna blow! Quick! Stuff these noodles up his noodle! <laughs> there! There's no way you can sneeze now! No, no way at all. <laughs> okay, I might be a teensy bit sick. <sighs> Day 437. We're scaling the perilous breakfast burrito bluff high on Mount Yuck. One false move and it's over. But there's no turning back. Everyone knows what happens when mountaineers get stranded. Hey, stop eating me. No. <laughs> Doctor's law. Things are terrifying. We can't tell how leader he's unconsciously afraid of heights or he'll freak out and doom us. Why is everyone so quiet? Man, check that awesome view! I've never been up so high. <laughs> yeah! Pizza Face, stop doing that! You'll cause a landslide! Stop doing what? And how could I possibly cause a landslide? <laughs> because you're afraid of me now! As if I could 
cause Alexa. Uh, 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 uh. We did it! We made it to the top. Oh, the top made it to us. Whatever. Victory! Made only sweeter by the perils we overcame. Sparkles almost lost her fizz. We nearly drowned in nacho cheese. But we made it. Thanks to the steely courage and smoldering good looks of our great leader, me. I hereby claim Mount Yuck in the name of all that is gross. <laughs> Boy, it's a good thing we didn't tell you you're unconsciously afraid of heights. Cuz, then you would have freaked out and caused a disaster, probably killing us all. Sorry? I said, it's a good thing we didn't tell you you're unconsciously afraid of heights. Cuz then you would have... <laughs> Forget it. Afraid of... <laughs> hey, Egghead, come back! Yeah, we're sorry, buddy. We didn't mean to laugh at you. Where are you? According to my calculations, he could be. Anyway, watching a rabid raccoon devour a rotten cantaloupe in the alley, witnessing a flock of pigeons poop on cars from the window, gazing at the majesty of dead rats floating through the sewer. I'm not dumb. I'm not. There's nothing but smarty pants thoughts rumbling around in this old noggin boy. Nothing but. Ooh, hey, it means. It's mine! Come back!